Jason, congratulations on a big away win. What was the message before kickoff for such a big game? Well, we need to make sure that we come to a place like this and get a result because in, driving up here, it was it was a it was one of them where we haven't we can't remember the last time we went away from home. You know what I mean? So it was a massive win for us tonight. Um, you know, we've come close against Salford and York. Where we've got points at York, and, we, and we, we should have probably got a point at Salford. But the lads were immense tonight. You know, I thought first half we were better uh, with 11 when they had 11 men than we were when we had 10. But ironically, we scored two great goals. It's not often we score from a set player, but you know what a ball in from Sparking. You know, you won't see a better header. It doesn't matter what level of football you're at um, than, than James. You know, and, and then AJ does what he does best. He he gambled on, on a diagonal ball and, and coolly slotted away. You know, it was nerve-wracking stuff at the end because you know they're, they're a top they're a top quality outfit. You know, and, and they gambled and they pushed people forward and you know we gave away too many free kicks second half really to, for, for my liking. But kind of question the effort and, and the spirit and and, and and the fitness levels. You know, because I keep saying it. You know, we're a fit bunch, and I think that proved it tonight against an you know an outstanding outfit, um, technically very good, and, and they've got players that can really hurt you. But I think on the on the day. I don't think Dan's had a great deal to do. They've put great balls in the box, um, but, but shots-wise, I don't think he's had he's had much to save. Um, neither's there probably, keep, but it was a great game for the neutral, I would imagine. And um, you know, delighted for, you know to put a performance in in front of a, a large travelling support, which was which was brilliant. You know, we, you know, and the lads rose to the occasion. Two wins over Harrogate this season. Where does that rank in a growing list of achievements, really, for the club over the last few years? Yeah, to, to beat the full-time outfit who were challenging at the top twice, three-one and two-one, you know, is, is a brilliant achievement. But it's no good beating the Harrogates and, and you know in the Stockport at home, and then going to other places and just you know thinking we're going to get three points because that was like chalk and cheese against Leamington. We, you know, I don't think I think we we're lucky to get three points against Leamington, who, who were the better side on the night. But then we've come here and, and, and put a real performance in. So it's one of them where we've got to be a bit more consistent. I don't think the break helped us, if I'm honest. You know, over Christmas and, 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 the, and the weather. But we've certainly hit the ground run tonight. Um, an immense performance from everybody.